Hi there and welcome back to the life of Nello. Today we'll talk about 10 essential items you should get before you get your Italian Greyhound puppy. Let's get started! Okay, so first of all, the 10 items I'm going to talk about are just recommendations and just the essentials. You can go overboard and buy so many different things, but those 10 things are what we bought before we got Nello. And just so you know, I, I will put a link in the description box to our blog post on this topic and it will have all the links to the items we will talk about so you can check them out for yourself. First on the list, dog food. <laughs> and I'm not going to talk about what kind of dog food you should feed because that just depends on your personal preference, also what your puppy likes best. But um, of course you need to get something and I would definitely recommend to buy a puppy formula. Ask the breeder what they are feeding the puppy right now and feed them the exact same food. And why is that? Because moving uh, for the puppy is already exciting enough and you don't want to change everything. I mean, the complete environment for the puppy is changing and some puppies um, will have a little bit of an upset stomach the first few days, which is totally normal. Um, but changing the food as well will just make the whole thing even more complicated. So stick what they're already used to and slowly transition to something else after a few weeks. Number two on the list is feeding supplies. And um, yeah, it's empty now, I'm sorry. <laughs> but of course you will have to get like a food bowl and also a water bowl. Um, there are also many options you can choose from. We got something like this. We have two of those. And I just find this very convenient because it's super easy to clean. You can just buy different plates, I guess, and um, just put them in a dishwasher. And also the, the back here has like rubber things so it won't slip. And yeah, that's just very convenient. Item number three is a dog bed and of course Italian greyhounds love to be with you and if you let them they will sleep on the couch and in bed with you but I would just recommend to get at least one dog bed so they have their own private area to uh, sleep and just recover. <laughs> um, tip number four get soft blankets because Italian greyhounds love to be snuggled up in a blanket. They love sleeping under a blanket. And um, even during summertime, they don't mind if it's too hot. I think there is no such thing as too hot for an Italian greyhound. So make sure it's like a really soft one that is very snuggly, cuddly. And yeah, that, that, would, that would be ideal for an Italian greyhound. Next on the list, number five is get a collar with an ID tag. It doesn't have to be a good uh, leather one right from the start. I got like a, a nylon one when Ella was a puppy because puppies love to chew on everything and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money. Also, they will grow out of it very quickly. So it definitely makes sense to wait until you buy a high quality one until they're fully grown. I think we um, waited up to a year until we got the first leather one. But um, yeah, also I would definitely recommend to add an ID tag to it just in case you will never know and it can come in very handy in case your dog runs off and somebody finds them. Even though Nello is microchipped, it will just take way too long for the person who finds him to go to the vet and you know find out my number. So I have an, an, his name and on the back I have my cell phone number. So just in case when somebody finds Nello, they can call me. <laughs> Number six, get leashes. I would recommend to get two different types, just a regular one that will be for everyday use. Um, you can choose the length you prefer, but also get a long training lead, um, just because I recommend if you want to train your dog to be off leash and you're not very comfortable with it yet, you can start with a leash that's long, about 15 feet long and just leave it attached to your dog and practice their recall. So you will have a safer feeling because they're still attached to a lead. <laughs> Number seven, toys. <laughs> we have many toys to choose from. Apparently Nello is really interested in this one right now. I would really recommend to get a rope toy like this one because 
It is very helpful when they are teething because they can chew on it and it will soothe their pain. And also you can play tug of war with it. And yeah, also we got like a red little ball where we can hide treats in, which is very nice because it will keep the puppy distracted and you would definitely want something that can keep them distracted because they can be very crazy little monsters when they're puppies <laughs> and um, something that will keep them occupied is always a good idea. Number eight on the list, Danella will not like it, is a nail clipper. Um, because of course Italian greyhounds, they don't require a lot of maintenance but you will eventually have to cut their nails. Um, and also I recommend to start at an early age because then it will be easier to get them used to it. This is just a simple one, nothing special, but it, yeah, it works. <laughs> okay, so next on the list, also an item you will need for dog maintenance <laughs> is a toothbrush and a canine toothpaste. Yeah, Nello, he loves this one. It's really funny, he actually likes eating it. <laughs> Want to try it? See? See? Mmm. Yeah? Is it good? <laughs> um, you can get just a basic children's toothbrush because it's super soft and small so it will work just fine. But it is important to get a canine toothpaste because I think the human ones, they have stuff in it that's not good for dogs. So make sure you get one that only has safe ingredients. Yeah, and last but not least, it can be very helpful to get a dog camera because if you want to teach your dog to stay home alone, um, you can turn it on while you're gone and you will know what they're doing while you're gone. Also, some of them, they, they will send you notifications when your dog is barking or whining at home and um, it will just give you a, a safer feeling while they are home alone. So it's definitely an item I would recommend to get. So those were just the essential items. Of course, you can get so much more. Some people get a crate, for example, if you wanna crate train your puppy, which we didn't do. Um, also, some people get pee pads. Um, that is if you want to have your dog to have indoor potty options, which we also didn't do. Um, I made a video on Italian Greyhound potty training. If you wanna find out why, check it out. I will put a link in the description box below. What was that? Are you talking to me? <laughs> I think he's eating my hair. Nom, nom, nom. Hmm? <laughs> um, if you have any more questions or if we missed something that you think is important to get, let me know in the comments below. I hope you liked this video. If you did, leave us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And I hope to see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.